Thanks for being here. I'm John Erickson. This is your NBC 26 News Update. And Foxconn could collect up to $80 million in tax credits under its new incentive contract with the state of Wisconsin, much less than the $2.85 billion under the original agreement. When the first deal was signed back in 2017, the company was supposed to create up to 13,000 new jobs in the Badger State. That number is now slashed to fewer than 1,500 jobs by 2026 in order to see any of those tax credits. Regulators in Europe said today the Johnson & Johnson COVID-19 vaccine should carry a warning for the rare risk of blood clotting, but did not recommend it be pulled from use there. A CDC advisory panel, meantime, will meet Friday to discuss next steps here in the U.S., after that vaccine, the Johnson & Johnson COVID-19 vaccine was halted nationwide. Of the nearly 8 million Americans who received the shot, six women developed serious blood clotting, leading to one death. We remain very confident and we're hopeful that the uh, benefit risk profile will play out. Let's turn to a check of our weather now. Here is Chief Meteorologist Cameron Moreland. Cameron? John, tomorrow's going to be a lot like today. We're going to see a little sunshine early, then mostly cloudy skies with some on and off snow showers or flurries. If we can get any snow showers going, they could be briefly heavy with some accumulations possible, especially on grassy surfaces. High temperatures will be in the lower to mid 40s. Sunshine returns for Thursday with highs in the upper 50s to around 60, upper 50s to lower 60s on Friday, increasing clouds a chance for a shower. Mostly cloudy on Saturday, a better chance for a few showers as a cold front moves through. Behind that cold front on Sunday, we'll see sun and clouds and cooler temps in the lower 50s. And then we will start to warm up again. Looks like mid 60s on Tuesday, but there's going to be a wide range of temperatures, possibly 40s near the lake close to 80 across parts of central Wisconsin. Of course, I'll fine tune the forecast as we get closer. Have a great night.